Extract the files by double-clicking the zip file. Go to Home, Movies, Motion Templates, Titles. Copy or drag all items. Drag the folder with the name of the pack into the Transitions folder. All items are now ready to be used in Final Cut Pro X. You can see the items in the title browser. Now you can use all presets from the package. Drag an item into your timeline. To configure go to T, Title Inspector. Use Scale to zoom in or out. Use Position to move. Use Rotation to move. You can also use Transform for faster positioning and scaling. Use source text to change text. Use color change tag color and increase or decrease the duration, it will not affect the speed of animation playback. To change the font, scale and more detailed settings go to, Text Inspector tab.
Dragon item into your timeline. You can turn off the line by clicking on the check mark. You can turn off the icon by clicking on the check mark. Use the line side to select the template position left and right. Select icon type. Select the icon you need. Use scale icon to increase or decrease the icon. To change the position of the line use position icon X and Y. Use width line to change the line width. Select your photo or video by clicking on drop zone. Use media from library's sidebar press apply clip. Use scale and pan to change media settings. To use the transitions activate the transition browser. Use the transition by dragging it to the timeline and selecting the speed. Drag an item into your timeline. By the standard, background is attached to the input and output animations. This can be disabled by clicking on the check boxes. Hand is the color of the backgrounds use shadows, midtones, highlights. Select optional element or typography from the pack and drag to the timeline. Add an element and position using the position. 